Hello and welcome to this video tutorial by ComputerGaga.com In this video we're going to look at 5 awesome uses of the Flash Fill feature of Excel 2013 So Flash Fill is a new feature to Excel 2013 an extremely powerful and amazing tool that if you haven't had a chance to look at yet these examples are going to blow your mind I couldn't believe it the first time I saw it and uh, the difference it can make uh, maybe some existing techniques you have to do uh, to achieve some of the things we're going to look at in this video and the first thing we're going to look at here for flash fill is we're going to use it to extract the first name and surname for the names mentioned down column B here B4 to B8 so without further ado, we're going to get stuck straight in. I'm going to show you a couple of different ways of running Flash Fill as well. First way, definitely my preferred way. So in cell C4, I'm going to type in an example of the first name, you know, what I want to achieve. So I'm going to type Ian, as that is the first name of the first person in there. I'm going to hold down Control and press Enter on my keyboard. So I want to confirm my entry but I don't want to move to the cell below C5 as a normal press of enter or return would do unless you've changed settings and then we're then going to use the keyboard shortcut control E control and E for echo is the keyboard shortcut for flash fill make sure you've got the cell selected that you need and that will flash fill to the bottom of the column so just four more cells for us but just how good is that already? I can do the same now for the surname. I can put Turner, Control Enter, Control E, and I've got the surnames. And I've immediately extracted first name and surname from the names in a column. Something you may previously have had to play around with the likes of, well, text to columns, hopefully, that you may even have dabbled in formulas. Uh, like left, right, mid, find, as we'll see with our later examples here. So, straight on to the next, really, where then formulas would have been more handy, where we want to extract a name from an email address. So, now there's a full stop in between the name, there's some data after it. Can Flash Field pick up the pattern and understand what I'm going to do? I'm even going to put a capital J and a capital T. So I'm changing the case of the text as well, and Control Enter, Control E, and it has got it. It will extract the name from an email address. Okay, now we're going to look at reversing names with a bit of concatenation. I want to put Turner, comma space Ian. So I'm going to write Turner, comma space Ian. Give it one example of what I'm trying to achieve. I'm going to press enter normally because this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to select Ian Turner down to the other cells and I'm not doing this because it's this example I'm just showing another way of running it and I'm going to go for the data tab and the flash fill button on data tools there so this is a manual way of running it selecting the necessary range and pressing flash fill and it will apply it to a necessary range. Ensure the first cell you select is the one that has the pattern you're trying to copy. And now with reverse of data, you know, put in a comma itself, added some text, bit of concatenation. Okay, now we've got a date example. With the year here, I'm going to type 2012, my first example, and I'll use my control E example, and we can get the year from a date. And finally, possibly the most complex one, I want to extract text between two characters. So we've got text here in between in this example. You know, it's different lengths. Four characters there, three here, three here. There's no pattern apart from the fact that there's a forward slash each side. You know, different varying numbers at the beginning and the end as well. But if I put JSLD, Control Enter, Control E, and it can do that. It can strike the text between two characters. So five brilliant examples of flash fill there. 
it is not limited to just this but I'll try and use the examples these are common things that people ask for and th they show the difference of what flash fuel can do it can extract data it can concatenate data it can reverse it it can change the case of text it can do so much that in previous versions of Excel you may have used functions like upper and proper concatenate left right you might have done text to columns uh, so much that you may have had to do to do it and they're still available they still have their needs but fast fill mind-blowing data manipulation there okay thank you for watching please check out some of our other tutorials on our YouTube channel or at computergaga.com